Okay, right now I'm going to be showing how to prep an IV bag um, with a vial mate adapter, which looks like this. What you need, hand sanitizer, alcohol wipes, your vial of medicine. Um, this one's in a powdered form. Um, it's a bit different if it's in a liquid form. Um, and your bag of fluid. Um, this is just saline. Um, sometimes it's a different fluid that you mix it in. So, first thing you do, always, put some hand sanitizer on your hands. Okay. Um, then, you see the cap? You pull the cap off, like that, and that can just be thrown in the trash. So then, so you see the little rubber seal on the inside there. Then, you take your Vialmate adapter and peel it open, where it says peel open. It's kind of handy like that. And take it out. Um, you do want to be careful not to touch either end. Both of them have needles inside them when you collapse the tubing. Um, don't take the foil off just yet. So the first thing you want to do, don't put this down once you take it out, is take an alcohol wipe and wipe the top of it with the rubber seal like that. And then wipe the inside of this a little bit. Then you're going to take it and just click it together click it's it's not that easy so you wiggle it on like that and you'll hear a pop you probably heard that um, then you take this there's two sites here this is for the IV bag and this is for the vial mate adapter or a needle um, and I'll show you how to do it with a needle in a different video so there's that and this all set up you're going to want to take your second alcohol wipe and wipe this here. Wipe that down really good, or really well, rather. Grammar, it's fun. And then peel the foil off of the top and wipe that down with alcohol, but don't touch the inside of it. And you can see, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a needle inside of there. Um, so you take it, this part here, and shove it through. You'll hear a click or a pop at some point. Like that. And then just shove it on in until it's flush with the saline bag or whatever bag you're using. Um, how this works is see these lines here? You want to put them together. You'll hear a click. And then, let me get a little closer to the camera here. Oh, hold on one second. My bed is tilting downwards, making it difficult to stay in one place. Then you're going to grab it, grab it, grasp it at the top and at the bottom. And make sure the lines are in place and click it together. And what you want to do is squeeze the saline bag until the vial is half full with liquid. Um, if it's already a liquid, you don't have to do this. So just keep squeezing it until, see that's about half full. And then just kind of shake it back and forth so the powder dissolves. And then what you want to do is flip it upside down, and you're going to squeeze the air into the vial. And then release, and keep going until all of the liquid is out of the vial and back into the bag. It's best to get as much of the air out as you can and see all the little air bubbles if you just flick it. 
they'll stop being bubbles and just turn them back into the air pocket. Because, um, like in the other video, um, that I did, um, I, I showed, well, not showed, but said that if there's air in it, it creates a vacuum and shoves it through the tubing, um, which you don't want. So, there's that, and we're going to flip it. There's usually still a tiny bit of liquid left in the vial, no matter what you do. Uh, I wouldn't worry about that too much. So, what I like to do, just to make sure if I squeeze the bag accidentally, none of it goes in the vial, is pull it apart. Not this, but pull the blue and white part apart. And then take it out of position by clicking it. And you can just leave it on. Uh, when you're done with it, you do want to take it off, both of the bag and the vial. Uh, I mean, when, when you're done with it, meaning when the bag's empty. You do want to take this off because it should be put in a sharp container because it has a needle in both ends. Um, that would be unpleasant for anyone working with your garbage. Um, so there you go. And then you just shake the bag a little bit to mix all the medicine in. And you're all set to hook it up to the line and prep the bag. Well, not prep the bag, and prep the line. Sorry, lime brain. So there you go.